Hey there. Bye. Right, should be off the mod. My stuff now. Let's try it again. If I can increase quality of the mods that I'm using. Use that one for now. Ultimately, I'd like that, but I need to increase my power a bit more. Yeah, so we can go up to 55% extra damage. Do it. What have we got here? Can't use I don't have enough power, but that will do for now. Right, let's have a look at the turret. Another one of my uh, weapons, skill heist 25%, or we can go with ammo box. Extra mortar ammo. Don't even use mortar, so. Might be worth unlocking it though. Extra mortar ammo, skill haste. Uh, skill haste is the best one for now, till I unlock some other modes extra sniper ammo extra damage I think I'll go with the extra damage right see what stuff I can unlock hello Thanks. I got all the stuff I can can deal with so that's fine let's go to the turret so you can not mortify apparently don't think you can not that i can see incendiary mode i'm not sure what that was about then i'll we'll leave Take it at care. that get out of here Okay, so I've got some stuff I need to do around the West End, recover four SHD tech caches. Uh, Summer Strong says is... Hold on. Summer Strong says is 8,300 megahertz for every 27... 270 core good for 2080. Yeah, the memory overclock's good. But uh, the uh, overclock on the. Sorry, I just realized my fans are not on. So just give me a second. I'll get that, get that resolved. I'm <laughs> running at like 80 degrees at the moment. Bear with me. <sighs> get my profile. That's messing around. All right, I'm gonna have to end my stream very quickly and come back. I won't be too long. Bear with me. Sometimes this software is a bit funny. I have to sign out and sign back in. So I actually have to end the game. So just give me a second. Just software based fan controllers can sometimes do this. I'm just gonna sign out real quick. Sign back in, this usually kills the problem. Do this again. I don't know why it does this. Annoying. This MSI Dragon Center, sometimes it doesn't detect your um, fans properly, and then it doesn't run, run them on a profile that you've saved. So it's doing it now, so that's okay. So I'm just gonna load my default overclock. You guys can see behind the scenes, nothing special really. And I can just load up my Uplay. 
a good job about having a streaming PC. You don't need to. Um, you don't need to. Oh, what the hell? I don't want to do my two-step verification right now. I'm going to jump straight back into Division. It's a good job I never started a mission or anything. So that's okay. Amir Avvc says, hi there. How you doing? Right, time to go. Do this again. Okay, we're back. And attempts are normal. So I just had a look at my course thinking, why the hell am I below two gigahertz? That's not normal. It just it was just that my fan controller wasn't working properly, so all good. Anyway, I've got a mission I need to do. So I'll go go to the west end and get all of these tech caches. So If there's any around here. I think the best thing for me to do is just go and do the this mission go first. The stronghold of the remains of the quarantine site where they were held. They've been here a long time and know the area intimately. We believe that capturing Roosevelt Island and neutralizing Emmeline Shaw, the outcast leader, will seriously weaken the faction and may even cause it to disintegrate. Okay, this may be the quickest way to it. Ashan Shahid says, hey bro, how you doing? the max memory I can do I can I can put a thousand on the core but I don't like I don't like doing that because I don't have um cooling on my memory chip so I don't like to overclock them too much so because I'm using hybrid cooling solution um it's less protected so I don't want to push the memory too hard so I leave it at the most I go really 700 I don't go any higher than that but my core will do 2130 if I want it to, so um, I'm happy with that. And it, and my card maintains over two gigahertz at all times. This overclock is my streaming overclock. I, I want it to be stable 100% in every situation. You'll find in some situations where you've got a high overclock, it will be stable for every game. When you start using RTX features like ray tracing, um, it might crash. So with this overclock, it's stable in all situations. So. That's why, if you're wondering why my clock, core clock seems a bit lower than normal, that's why. Let's take these guys down. I love that 120 round clip, gets the job done. Damn. Guys out. My drone will deal with this guy. I 
Hassan Shahid says, I never miss your videos. Thanks for the support. Thanks for tuning in. Do appreciate it. Took him down. Will I get the will I get the ten nine at ninety K? Friendly control point detected. Um I mean if it's just an extra two cores, I don't think so. But if it is some significant chipset changes like Pisa Express four point some other stuff, then yeah, maybe, but we'll have to see. My priority this year is to get my thirty eighty Ti and whatever high end AMD card comes out. Those are my two priorities. Everything else it doesn't really matter to me. Because I've already got a good CPU for both systems. I've already got a good GPU for both systems. All I want to do is increase my GPU power. And then the CPU can get dealt with after that. I'll speak to this person. Get into position. What is this? Good for you. This I don't know what this is for, but whatever. Awesome. There's the next one. Don't see it. Anyway, I'll do this another time. Refill my ammo. So, um, Carlos de Bernard says, cool emoji with thumbs up. I mean, Havisi says, go with Ryzen 3950X. If I wanted that, I would already have it. I want something better than that. If I go Ryzen, um, I need something better than that as well. The cores are good, but, um, nah, for me, it's not worth it. I'd rather wait for the new Ryzen to come out and see how good that is. I've already got a 3900X, which I'm quite happy with. Uh, the 3950X for me, it's not worth the money. I've got to change motherboard. I've got to change water block. I've got to change um, CPU. It's just too, it's too expensive. It's not worth it. Okay, guys, dingly at the mission that I need to do, so things are going to get interesting. Let me just take out these punks here. One down. This guy I thought he could. That guy's a fool. Friendly supply on fight in proximity. I don't think so, mate. Son Shahid says, bro, I think you should try a PUBG PC, PUBG Mobile and Fortnite, all these kind of games. I've got I've got play under unknown battlegrounds, I just don't really play it. Um I've got some videos on it. I've just gotta search my channel. Not really I don't really care for um Battle Royale. I'm not not really fond of the uh, the play style. But it's been a while since, I don't think I've ever done that video at 4K, so you know what, I may even do some PUBG today. Not live stream, of course, but I'll do like a video and put it up on my channel possibly. So you'll get your wish. Got a day off today, so I've got time. Drink your 
drinking water detected. Got to scavenge around because you never know what perks some of this gear has. And now I can kind of um, tinker and kind of what's the word? Trying to find the word. Let me quickly go in here. Yeah, because you can calibrate um, your guns on this game. Even if the weapon isn't better than what you have, it might have a specific perk that you can transfer onto the gun that you do want to use or the armor that you do want to use. So it's worth collecting everything and just seeing what they have. Then if they're rubbish, just get rid of them or sell them after. Anyway, you know, these guys look like they need a hand, so I'm going to help them. Who the hell are you guys shooting at? Let's try some sharp shooting. Oh, headshot. Taken down. That's your problem. Right, taken down. These guys was lucky I was here. I was struggling with these boys. Okay, I think I'm good to go. Amir Havisi says, already I have 8700k and 9900k, but I'm trying saving money for Aorus Extreme 570 and 3950x. Hope to get it before summer. Yeah, well, you know, that's what you want, then that's what you want. But, um, you know, I'm, I think I'm okay with what I've got at the moment, personally. Um, I'll, keep, point detected. I'll keep an eye on the 1090k, of course, but don't expect anything special from it. Intel, I don't know what they're doing. They're not really making, even with all the pressure that AMD are making, they're not really doing anything to, to win back any popularity. They're not trying hard enough, in my opinion. They've got all that money. Surely it'll be feasible to bring something out that will just Friendly combatants detected. put them back on the map because right now AMD are just beating them on every single every single way in price and performance so it's just it's their problem they should have seen it coming and uh, started to anticipate it but they're so ignorant Intel are so ignorant that they thought uh, Ryzen wouldn't be a threat well Due to the infinity fabric and the weight and the speed that AMD can just keep upgrading, they can't really keep up. Plus, they haven't even got 7 nanometer fabrication done yet, so Intel are kind of screwed for a little while. So, I don't know, we'll see what they do in the future. I'm just going to have a look a word with this person see if they need anything. Um, X, XYZ to the B says, hey, what's up, Banks? Sliding through before I head out to work. Thank you, Agent. Thanks for the support, man. Thanks for dropping by. Um, Amir Ham Havasi says 14 nanometer, 14 plus. Yeah, they need to get down to 10, 10 nanometer. I've heard they're having issues. And 7 nanometer, they're not even talking about it. So I don't know what Intel are doing. So, hey, who knows, man? Keep an eye on things, but for now, with a 9900K and a 3900X, I'm I'm quite happy. Friendly control point nearby. Plus, I'm doing 5.1 gigahertz and staying under 70 degrees. So, what's not to like? Very good CPU. All right, I gotta get down here. There's so much stuff to collect on this game, you've got to be vigilant when you miss out. Man, 
Man, this map is huge. I feel like I've been running forever. What's this? XYZ to the B says, gotta pick up Zombie Army 4, bro. Game is super fun on 9 4 player co op. Yeah, I've seen a few people play that up. To be honest, I'm a bit burnt out with all the zombie stuff. I played Left 4 Dead, the new one, I beat that game. Um, there's too many zombie games, in my opinion. Then there was, I think DayZ came out. Uh, now they're bringing out Army, uh, Zombie Army 4. So, I mean, they just it's just so many, so many zombie games. They're all the same to me, in a way. I'm not that, like, eager to get it, but, you know, I might get it. Possibly, we'll see. Detected from the control point in proximity. <sighs> All right, let's take these guys out. It's gonna. There's quite a few of them, so I want to make. Want to make sure I set up my my support. So why can't I get behind this? Not big enough, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna have to kill these guys. And then uh, just move up. Let's go. Where are you going? Okay, I need to get, get down and heal. Just about survived that altercation. All right, I'm gonna get my uh, drone out. Oh, these guys ain't playing. Get my sniper rifle out for this dude. Damn, they're quick. Let me heal myself. Guy, if you can see, can flank me. It's not happening. Let's kill that guy over there. Damn. Damn. These guys are fighting good as a team. Cleared out the first slot, so I'm okay. Um, let's collect anything that they have. Captain underscore Cole says hello. Uh, being playing division for about two weeks. I'm about to do the tier three stronghold to unlock tier four, doing it all solo, and it's awesome fun. I agree. Game is the game's fun on solo, but even be even better when you've got a group, of course. But yeah, it's a super fun game. Um, I remember when the first one I played the Division 1, I didn't think it was any good. And then I kind of gave it a second chance and I really enjoyed it. And then I got really into it. And uh, yeah, Division, it's awesome, man. Nothing wrong with it. Definitely give it a try. Okay. Get my drone out there. I'm going to get my sniper out here as well. This will uh, help take out a few guys. Yep. Yeah. I'm right. I can shoot you guys without me needing to do anything. And it's got super good aim as well. See, the turret sniper is just sick. It's taking these guys out without even needing to do anything. It's just a matter of who can rain down the most bullets. Okay, all good. There's a sniper over there as well. I need to take him down. It's okay. I got my own, got my own sniper rifle. So let's see if he can shoot first. Yes, I can. Reload.
Thomas Sean says, will you get 4K 130 for the 134 Hertz monitor? No. I've got an LG B9 and I've got a Samsung Q90. I both can do 4K 120 Hertz. Don't need any more than that for now. Don't even have the graphics card to push that kind of frame, frame rate. So in the future, maybe, but it's no rush. And honestly, I've never really been a high refresh rate junkie. 120 Hertz for me is more than enough. I'm not really a competitive gamer like that. I prefer slow paced RPGs and um, like um, Deus Ex Mankind Divided and play games like that. I mean, I like Battlefield and stuff, of course, but I'm more of a casual player than anything. I'm not. Taking down the outcast stronghold and neutralizing their leader, Emmeline Shaw, will do serious damage to the faction. Also, Henry has intel that a mechanical engineer from the campus settlement was brought here recently, so be on the lookout for captives. Got a few hostiles ahead. Okay, trying to get to your comments there. Captain Cole says Division 1 had a bad start, but after a few patches, came really good. Number 2 has better end game stuff, though. Kind of laughing out loud. <laughs> uh, Cheyenne Niazi says Watching with Intel HD graphics. Oh man, that sucks. You'll have to upgrade at some point, I guess. Okay, so I've got to reach the quarantine zone. And I'm gonna be some hostiles holding me back, of course, but let's uh let's take these guys out as quickly as possible. Get some cover. You want me to burn? I'm not burning anywhere. You can burn. I know this. Yeah, I knew there was one more. Alright, that's all taken care of. Let's go and grab some ammo. Don't want to run out. There's an ammo refill zone here anyway. Um, Captain Hole said, really enjoyed Roosevelt. Um, Stronghold, that's what I'm doing now, so. Don't ruin it for me, but uh, finally getting on with the game. I went around and did. Okay, let's set my sniper rifle up. Just for some added support. All right, let's do this. All right, they didn't stand. They didn't stand a chance. All right, let's go. See what you dropped. I really like the graphics of this game. I think it's quite underrated. I mean, if you look around, the amount of foliage and detail they've put in this area really does look like it's a junkyard slash um, post-apocalyptic kind of type scenario. That's a lot of stuff to actually have to put in. So, I mean, I do give this game props for the... The art design and just the overall aesthetic, it does look really, really good. It might be nothing, but it might be something. Is that supposed to be helpful, Earl? Because it isn't. Shut your damn mouth before I shut it for you. Both of you shut up. Okay. Take these guys out. These guys thought they could ambush me, but it's not really going to happen. I'm ready for anything. Just want to get some more ammo real quick. Uh, didn't really need anything, it seems. Alright, who else wants it?
You guys, huh? Oh, that, that looked painful. Come on then, show yourselves, you cowards. Okay, I guess we have to move forward. Uh, Nando Trezzi says Brazil. Captain Cole says, don't worry, I would never ruin it unless you ask me to. It's horrible when someone does that. Um, I increased draw distance and turned on natural lighting, which makes the game even look better. Natural lighting is good when it's really, because it's only really for when it's dark and it doesn't, you don't have a artificial light source. If there's not a light source where you are, then it will be pitch black, which can make it a bit difficult in some cases, like uh, Dark Zone. Kill these guys. Just busy dealing with my drone. Let's see what's up here. If nothing, this is just a good point to snipe from. Sim says, hey. Nando Trezzi says, esta no nivel 23. Um, I don't speak Portuguese, so I'm not too sure what that means, but welcome to tune in and get involved. There might be some other um, speakers who understand what you're saying. Okay, there's something I need to pick up, so I'm gonna quickly go and check that out. I don't really like abandoning loot because you never know what it could be. So let's have a look what that was. Uh, so Nando Tracy says he has Z39 motherboard, i7 9700K, and RTX 2080 Ti Galax. Good PC. Really, really good PC. All right, let's go. Uh, Thomas Sean says, Freddy I will get 4K 144 hertz in Battlefield 5. I probably will. But for the majority of games that are to come out, um, I don't think so. It's definitely not going to do that in Cyberpunk. Um, and there's still probably a few games he won't be able to do that. But 120 FPS? No, it's more realistic aim at the moment. We're barely getting 60, let alone doubling that. Take these guys out. Make sure no one's trying to sneak up on me. I want to show yourself, you coward. shot kill shot kill
Come on, show yourself. One shot kill. Reload. Make sure I'm not being flanked, which I am. So, I'm gonna reload and take this person out. that's about it for now Captain Cole says more realistic to say that upcoming for OT80 Ti will get 4K 144 FPS in older games but will not in new graphically intensive games like Cyberpunk and even games like Metro Maxed Out I agree I mean you got to look at it this way yes you're getting a new graphics card yes it will probably be able to dominate some of the older games but you got to think about the games that are up and coming and that's what you're going to really be playing you're not going to go and binge on all your classics so looking forward, you know, the Freddy ATTI will keep you playing closer to probably 90, 100 FPS at 4K with the newer titles rather than 144 locked, which would be quite the ask for 4K. I mean, if it can do it, I'll be very, very happy, but I just don't see it happening. Never seen the GPU leap so, so um, intense, but we'll see. I mean, my money's ready. Don't get it twisted. If it is that powerful, I'll be the, I'll be the guy to get it on day one. So we'll, we'll see what it can do. Can't wait for the reviews. Can't wait for the reveals. Can't wait for the specs. I don't do news kind of videos, but when it comes to the graphics cards, I will let you know what my opinion is. That's for sure. Yeah, and we're going to take them out. Yeah, don't worry, we will. What the hell? Why do I keep missing? Go. All right, let's throw a little grunt. Let's throw the sniper rifle up here just to give it some extra range. And I love the turret sniper. This does the job for you. <laughs> Four guys in one clip. Gotta love it. Okay, we've cleared the area. Just gonna have a quick scavenge around, see if there's anything good. as well recall my turret you know what i think i'm actually going to change i think i'm going to change my um my uh turret turrets just for me i mean the what's it called the drone i think i'll change the drone to the hive rather use the hive than so i'll go with Assign it to the drone slot. But it's trying to say I don't have enough power now to use both. I'm not too sure. I'll have to double check. But let me just mod this thing up. So now I've got some good stuff for it. Duration buff. What else do we have? Skill haste. And another one as well. System slot. That's it. So I guess it's one or the other when it comes to it, possibly. But this is the one I want to use. Because I think it'll be a bit more useful for me. Okay, I think I'll destroy this, possibly. I'll move back. All right. I guess we got more combatants. Let's do this. I've got to protect this girl. Not a good place for my sniper rifle.
Well, he wasn't much of a challenge. Sorry guys, I'll get to the comments. Jack Sparrow, yes I am. Why is my voice that obvious? <laughs> so I'll get to your comments as soon as I can. Just give me a chance I'm in a bit of a fight at the moment. Right. Take these guys out. Guys taking a pelt in. Man, these guys ain't offering too much resistance. I'm a little bit disappointed. Uh, KC Kashek, I think that pronounced. Bitsushkin says good PC build. Cheers. Captain Cole says I'm actually expecting the upcoming 3080 to be around 2080 Ti performance and the 3080 Ti to be around 20 to 30 percent faster. Just like almost every other new GPU release from Nvidia. Expecting um, experience talking. Yeah, I agree. They are trying to say that it can be anywhere up to 50%, but I think that could be under specific scenarios. You know how NVIDIA like to inflate things. 50% maybe in, um, um, what's it called? The, uh, the tensor cores situation. So for general um, rasterization, it could probably be 30%, but with like a... Um, tensor cores it more than likely be 50% faster but you know how Jensen just likes to throw a number out and not specify things so you so the media can just like go crazy with it but we'll see we all we all know how to read numbers and when the benchmarks comes out we'll learn the truth so um, as usual the benchmarks should come out and the review should come out before the products on sale so we can make a more informed decision whether or not to upgrade I'm gonna buy it regardless because it helps uh, generate interest on my channel. And as I said before to all of you guys, I enjoy testing hardware as much as I like playing games. So, bit of a hobby for me. I won't be ignoring what AMD are coming with. First big Navi. I'll definitely be getting that as well. So, for guys that don't really too enthusiastic about NVIDIA, um, you, won't be, you won't be missing out because I'll be getting the big Navi as well. Just got to... Put some hours in at work, I guess, but it's all good. It's what I like to do. Um, Samanosuke says, hey, bang for buck. Are you going to ever try Uncharted 4? Yeah, sorry, guys. I mean, I know I've got the PS4 Pro and I've got all of these games, but I just don't have the time to play them. I'm sorry, but I will definitely get round to doing all the PlayStation games at some point. Um, so... The next time I take some time off work, I'll definitely... What I plan to do, I did plan originally taking some time off in March for Final Fantasy VII Remake, but now that that's been re delayed to April, the next time I'm gonna take some time off is in April probably, um, for about a week, and then I'll be playing Final Fantasy VII Remake for all week, pretty much. So you guys can just watch me play that. I'll just stream, I'll stream my whole experience so you guys can see it for yourselves. But I literally bought the PS4 Pro for the Final Fantasy VII Remake. And uh, while I've got loads of PS4, I've literally got almost every single PS4 game that's worth earning. I've got Bloodborne. I've got like 20 something games. And I've, the only game I've played was so far really is um, Horizon Zero Dawn, which I've beat. I really enjoyed that. That should be coming to the PC apparently. So that'll be interesting. Definitely be doing some graphical comparisons there. And um, I've got Death Stranding now. I've got um, God of War 3. I've got Uncharted 4. I've got Uncharted. I've got um, Last of Us Remastered. I've got Bloodborne. I've got just like so many games. Game. Then you're going to have to find a way to unseal it. Electronic device detected. Right, let's have a look around, see if there's anything interesting. There seems to be an electronic device around here. I wonder. Have you forgiven them? Never. Of course not. How could you? How could anyone 
forgive what they did to us. But there's a difference between hating someone and hurting them. You don't think they deserve to be punished? No, 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 That's not what I'm saying. Of course you. they do. Who has their right to punish them? Not in vain. I don't know. It's not just our right. It's our obligation. To those that didn't make it. Do you understand? I understand. Okay, how do I get through here? Find C4, huh? Well, find C4 and uh, blast my way through. Have a look around. Oh, it's in here, it seems. Thomas John says, God of War 4, yes, good game. Yeah, I mean, I've got so many games I need to get through. I will eventually get through them. I might even put a picture up on my community page to show you exactly what games I've got. You guys can vote which game you want to see next. And I might um, stream one a little bit later. I've got some time. I've got a day off today, so I don't mind doing it. Wow, that was really, really bright. Okay, we're going to have some fighting to do now, so... Put down my sniper rifle. Let's go. Let's gotta hold these guys back, I guess. Between my sniper rifle and my my uh, LMG, shouldn't be any issues. Let's move forward. Ah, uh, my. Uh, Sniper rifle is a bit out of range here, so I'm gonna recall it. Deploy it somewhere else. Let's use my uh, my real sniper rifle. See if I can take a few of these guys out from range. Oh, I took that one down. Took that one down. Took that one down. That's three down. Come on, guys. Put up a bit more of a fight, will you? <laughs> Just shot our fuel tank and took him out. Hmm. How did I miss two shots? I think it's because I'm being shot. It kind of knocks you off balance. Let's use this hive that I've got. Let's throw it down here. I'm not trying to pull anything. I'm just trying to kill all of you guys. Let's put this up here. I don't know where this guy's going. Um, Samanuska says, are you looking forward to Doom Eternal? It's going to be badass on PC and apparently it has HDR support. Absolutely. Definitely getting that game. Really, really enjoyed the Doom reboot. And um, from it. Wow. That guy's gun is really strong. Yeah, definitely getting Doom Eternal. Looking forward to that. Game got delayed though, didn't it? Should already have been out. They're bound to be expecting you. Right, let's get rid of my uh, uh my hives already. I'm gonna recall this. Okay, let's move on. Try and find somewhere I can reload, maybe.
comes out March 20th. We're not too far then. Yeah, looking forward to it. Whoa, what the hell did that come from? What the hell was that? A group of hostiles is moving toward a boat on the east shore. They're escorting someone who appears to be unarmed. If Emmeline gets away, finding her isn't going to be easy. You've got to stop that boat. Captain Cole says Doom Eternal will be awesome. I'm also getting Resident Evil 3 as well. Yeah, Resident Evil 2, the remake, was awesome. Um, all the Resident oh, Evil games have been pretty good, important. to be honest. I guess she was trying to develop a vaccine or something and it didn't quite go according to plan, possibly. I'm just guessing. Anyway, where the hell do I go now? Reach the docks. Oh, you go here. Is there a way out from here? Oh yeah, this way. Oh, we've been here so long it's turned to night time. LED Gamer says afternoon. Yeah, man, jump in if you're playing. Come on, I can use some backup out here. If you want to jump in, Nelly, jump in. Very, very welcome to join join the crew, man. But uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. I'm trying to find a way over here. Probably have to climb up. I'm assuming climb up this way. What do I do now? Uh, this isn't the way. I don't know what I'm doing. What's up here? So there was some kind of tunnel they dug down here. That's probably where we gotta go. Find a way to the shore and make sure that boat doesn't get away. All right. Expecting heavy resistance, but I'm pretty sure I can deal with them. Uh, these guys are dug in. Probably not the best place to put my turret. It's a little bit out of range. Might recall it and deploy it somewhere else. Once I kill these guys. Yeah. Definitely not the best place to put it. All right, Nelly D says I'm rendering videos for next week. Fair enough. Primary target. What about Emmeline? Already aboard the boat. Assuming that was her. Alright, I'm gonna look around real quick. John get to a few comments now. John Cooper says I'm putting together a PC build and just have GPU left to buy. So far the Z390 Aorus Master 9700K 16 GB of G skill 3600 megahertz. Really, really good build. Uh John Cooper says looking forward to pair it with Samsung. RU71100 TV, 1440p 60Hz for the new AAA titles and 4K 60Hz for older titles. I watch a free GTA 5. What GPU would you get? I'm leaning towards 2080 Super. 
Um, yeah, I think that would be decent. Um, that would be a, probably a good choice. Nothing wrong with that, especially for what you're attempting to achieve. Um, let me just quickly refill my ammo while I'm here. Uh, have a look. Okay, get to a few more comments. Um, the Red Draco says, Sup, Buck, just got 44p24 hertz monitor to pair with this setup. It's insane. Try to do a video about it if you get your hands on one. I don't think I'll be going with a 240 hertz monitor anytime soon. I'm just looking forward to HDMI 2.1 to be enabled on the new graphics card so I can take advantage of my LG B9 OLED at 4K 120Hz with G-Sync. That'll be, that'll be good enough for me, to be honest. Um, Thomas John says, Sloppy Wet Blow Gamer has cancer. This is so bad. Yeah, I saw, I was re I was on, um, I think I was on Club 4 Gigahertz channel the other day and I saw them talking, so I think he said he's got oral cancer and he had to um, get some bit of his jaw removed to to get it sorted and then he had to um, have some bone from his leg put put back on his jaw and now he's going to have like chemotherapy and that so I wish him all the best don't know the guy never really spoken with him but it's not nice to hear about those kind of things so hopefully he goes through a full recovery and uh, you know gets back to full health anyway let's get back to the game gonna deploy my turret let's get it going you coward show yourself they actually took my turret out good job on their hands okay let's move forward there's a couple more hostiles coming over I better move back actually I'm too close like to deploy my turret and I'll put it up there oh, damn one shot kill You guys are pathetic. I got destroyed these two fuel tanks. Wouldn't be too hard. But I guess I gotta do this while holding these guys off. Let's get to it. Wow, that thing is really, really durable. One down. Go and get some more ammo. Where's the ammo at? Guess it's behind there. Can't get behind there right now, so have to that's what I have to deal with it you die okay. still got 600 rounds so I should still have enough to get the job done get to cover I'm gonna deploy my uh, my hive Uh. 
move forward. Hmm. Here's the other full tank. Try using some grenades, that might speed things up a bit. Got a few of them. Not that powerful, actually. Put this to cover me. Sorry guys, I'll get to your comments in a moment. Just bear with me. Damn it. Serious trauma detected. Yeah, I can see that. Oh man. I didn't realise I was on fire. So I'm gonna respawn, probably from the checkpoint. And I'll try that again. So yeah, took an L there. That's okay, we'll bounce back. Get it get the job done. Um Real Drake says nice. Also I have the Asus 144 Hz 4K one as well. I love the pitch quality and use it for single player games. I love the 14 for to be 24 Hz for PvP games. Anyway, as always, always love what you're doing. I wanted to give you a huge thank you for your videos. They've helped me tremendously keep doing what you're doing. All the best. Thanks very much for the support. Do appreciate it. Whoa. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I can see that. And these guys are not playing. I need to take them a bit more seriously. Damn it. Give me a second, guys. Damn. These guys won't even give me a second. I'm going to put this down. Provide some support. Put this down as well. Oh, this guy was able to flank me. And I'm getting my ass kicked here. Alright. I'll try it again this time. I need to be a bit more aggressive and be aware of my surroundings. So instead of running in, let's get my support set up first. And uh start the assault. Struggling here a little bit. Yeah, probably not the best to go up here. The guys on the LFGs, take them down. I mean about the guys flanking you. To be a bit more vigilant about that. Okay, let's move forward. I've got to take out these fuel tanks, I need to do them quickly as well. I'll try to keep my distance while doing this. Let's stay in one corner. Probably be the smart play. What I'll also do is I'll drop a hive just to keep me healed up as well. Focus on this fuel tank. Alright, I 
able to take him down. Yeah, matchmaking. I'd rather play with people, I know, but I'll be fine, I'll get it done. I haven't found a mission yet, I haven't been able to do it on my own. Whoa, there is a lot of guys coming now. Alright, I got something for you. LMG with 120 round clip. You guys thought you could flank me? Not happening. Alright, took them down. Oh, yeah, here's an idea. Cool down a bit. I want anyone else. Alright, but gotta get down. Come on, show yourselves. My hive down. Sniper rifle down. Good to go. Throw a grenade over there. Okay, we've destroyed the fuel tanks now. Told you I'd get it done eventually. It's all good, we got the job done. Where these guys came from? Quite a few of them, though. You guys want it? You got it. Okay, let's get onto this boat. Try the engine hatch. What the hell is that? What is the engine hatch? Is it this? Not too sure what that is. There's something else I gotta destroy, but I'm not too sure. Okay. Let's take these guys out. Captain Cole, you've done this level. Where's the engine hatch? Where do I have to? Just tell me what I've gotta shoot. What does it look like? All right, let's heal up.
A lot of guys around here. They want to see me die. This situation is just going to keep going until I find out what I'm actually meant to kill. It says destroy this engine thing, but I can't even see where it is. I'm going to destroy some random stuff. Oh, it's this. Okay. Fair enough back. Capital building is our final target. It's ripe for the picking. Let's do this. Without their leader and their stronghold, the outcasts are going to be much less of a problem than before. You know, what happened to them was horrific. But what they did was even worse. I just hope they're finally at peace. Okay, so I was able to uh, finally work it out. I <laughs> feel a little bit stupid now. Because it was literally just in front of me, but hey. All right, let's get out of here. So I did get a proficiency cash, so I may as well look at that and see what I got. Uh, nothing amazing, but whatever. See if we got any better guns. Nope, not that I can see. If we've got any better armor. No, I'm good. Alright, all the stuff I have is pretty much the best you can get, so... Well, the best I can get at the moment. Let's just get out of here. So they usually make shortcuts to get off the mission after you've done it, so I'm assuming. No, it's got to be around here somewhere. He doesn't want us to run back the old way. John Cooper says, what screen am I currently using? I'm currently using the LG B9. Um, 55 inch QLED, I mean not 55 inch OLED, got G-Sync, 120Hz support at 4K when HDMI 2.1 is available, has 120Hz um, support at, four, at 1440p though, which is decent if you want to play at that resolution, but I don't, so it's not really a massive deal for me. I don't even know what class I'm, I'm, I am. I've got a sniper rifle and I've got um, an LMG and I like to um, be able to kill a lot more enemies um, and I hate reloading, it's just long. So if I've got 120 rounds to use or if I've got 200 rounds to use, I can hold off at least three or four people running at me. Sir. 
Easy work. Let's get out of here. <clears throat> so, see if there's anything more significant I can do. I think I can do the. the control point in proximity. <clears throat> Incoming backup request. All right, let's have a look. Let's see what what needs to be done. So I can do this one now. The Capitol building. That'll be interesting, but that'll be for another time. I've been streaming for about an hour now, so I'm going to take a little break. But uh, thanks for tuning in, guys, and I'll uh, see you in the next stream.